tonight we're making some gluten-free banana muffins. What a better way to use your um, overripe bananas than mash them up and mix them in a bowl with some yummy chopped chips. So first step, we're gonna put the patty pans in the tray. Now add the wet ingredients to the bowl. We're gonna microwave the 125 grams of butter. We've got three eggs here. We're gonna crack them into the bowl and give them a nice little whisk. Using the whisk, take the melted butter out of the microwave, pour it in our mixing bowl. We're gonna use the peanut butter, half a cup. You could also use almond butter. There we go, we've got half a cup, add it to the bowl. Next, we've got three mashed, mashed bananas. I've left a few little pieces on the side to add as toppings later. There we go, close enough is good enough. A splash of vanilla essence. Gonna give this a nice mix. Finally, we're gonna add the eggs. We add them in last because we don't want the melted butter to start cooking those eggs whilst they're in the bowl. Gonna add our dry ingredients. So we've got <clears throat> half a cup of almond meal here. I've already added a pinch of salt. We're gonna add that in. Gonna add some cinnamon. There's half a teaspoon. There's a full teaspoon. Gonna add some baking powder. This is gonna help it rise. And then chopped chips. This is half a cup of chopped chips. You could also use some white chopped chips as well. Now to finish off, we're just gonna add a few slices of banana on top. Ready for the oven, 15, 20 minutes at 175 degrees. Here we go guys, straight from the oven, 12 delicious gluten-free muffins. I'll be alone.